Hey, what's going on guys? It's Wispin here, and I'm back with another video, and today I'm actually here to try and get some mega Pokemon. So the update was just rolled out onto the server, I think yesterday, was it yesterday? I, I don't know. Um, but either way, I actually, right as I was about to start recording, I was sitting here AFK for maybe like five minutes or so, and a Mega Venusaur spawned in. So we're going to try to defeat it. Shouldn't be too hard with like a Volcarona, and then we'll get ourselves a Mega Venusaur, I guess. This is actually happening a lot faster than I expected it to. I expected me to have to go around looking for like an hour. Um, but here we go. Okay, so if I just use Fiery Dance, it should do quite a bit of work. Almost one shot, and the Venusaur actually got burned, so there we go. That actually defeated it. That was that was really fast. Wow. Well, that's the end of the video, guys. <laughs> I already got my Mega. Only took like 15 seconds, so yeah, we got ourselves a Rare Candy, a um my game froze a wide lens vines a stick thanks for that i really appreciate the stick and a venus right so yeah okay so let's just go ahead and click take all and click right there and we actually should have our mega ring on now on our arm like that and we should be able to get a mega venusaur now the only problem is i don't think i have a venusaur so that could be an issue now i did see a bulbasaur somewhere around here but i think it may have despawned which kind of sucks like where did it go before i challenged the mega i saw the i saw the little venus or the little uh bulbasaur but yeah i don't know that's weird okay well we're gonna have to get ourselves a venusaur um before we can actually get ourselves a mega but we already got this stone and i would like to get some of the other stones um but if that, if that doesn't happen in the, this video i'll just make more videos trying to get those <laughs> Um, now the way spawning works, I'm kind of confused. I feel like maybe the spawning is just straight up. Venusaur spawns on grass, uh, Charizard spawns in the air, and uh, Blastoise spawns in water. I don't know if it's biome dependent, because I've seen Venusaurs in like extreme hills, and I'm pretty sure Venusaur doesn't normally spawn there. Um... But yeah, okay, let's go ahead and try and find ourselves a Bulbasaur. I don't know what biome we're going to have to look in. And uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and figure that out. Alright, so I got into a battle with a Bulbasaur inside of a forest biome. And we should be able to catch it pretty easily now. My game is a little bit laggy, and I've noticed that with the new update. I don't know if it's maybe because I have my settings changed to something weird or what's going on, but... I know a lot of other people have been having issues with lag too in the new update. I don't know. I feel like every time they roll out a new update, it it we ever it's like laggy for like the first couple weeks and then it just kind of goes away. I, I have no idea really. Um, but okay, let's just go ahead and use full swipe and that'll bring it down to one HP and we can go ahead and use ourselves an Ultra Bolt. So we only actually have to get to level 32 in order to evolve into Venusaur. So I think this last Pokemon should be able to do it. Um, this is like an enormous, uh, what is this thing called? Actually, I have no idea. Zangoose, right? I knew that, totally. Um, but let's just use Fire Dance, and we one-shot it, and is that enough? Okay, no, it's not. I thought that was going to be enough, um, but maybe one more Pokemon. We'll see how this goes. Okay, you know what? You're only level 28, but we'll see if maybe you can help us out here. If we can get into battle with you. Stop moving around so much. There we go. Okay, so, whoops. Oh, no, I clicked Quiver Dance <laughs> instead of... Uh, and I have a choice specs on, so I can only use one move. Okay, that's fine. We'll switch over to Dragonite. Pokemon look weird when they're in battle, don't they? I don't know. I feel like the, the shading or something is different when they're in a battle. It's kind of weird. Um, anyways, Aqua Tail, and there we go, and still <laughs> haven't evolved. Okay, well, I was wrong. I thought after, like, one more battle, we would go ahead and evolve, but apparently that's not the case. Only level 11? Wow, that's a little bit too low. Um, what level are you? 20, that's not bad, but level are you, Zangoose? 38, okay, we'll, we'll try this out, and we'll see if it works. Still not quite there. Meowth, you're a very high level Meowth. Bug Buzz, please level up, and there we go. Okay, so we are actually going to be evolving into crashing the game. That's fantastic. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, so I don't know what just caused my game to crash, but my Ivysaur is now evolving into Venusaur. We can go ahead and try out the Mega Evolution for the first time here on the server. This is going to be pretty cool. I think, um, okay, Petal Dance. That's actually, hmm. The user is then confused. It kind of looks like, 
the grass type outrage is that what that is i don't know i feel like i feel like outrage is pretty similar so the way that worked is it, it does 120 base power for two to three turns and then come yeah okay so pedal dance is apparently outrage for venusaur anyways um let's go ahead and try to go ahead and get into a battle if we put our mega stone where did our mega stone go oh it's right in the corner i was like oh no we lost it but nope it's right there i just am blind that's all right okay let's just get into battle with like something random here level seven whatever you are what, what is this thing i really i always forget the names of pokemon a centret or however you say that um mega evolution we're definitely going to need this in order to take out a level seven centret so let's just go ahead and do it um now venusaur doesn't really change too much with its mega evolution it just gets a couple more leaves and its tree gets a little bit taller or something like that not exactly sure um, but it's not the coolest Mega Evolution. I really like Mega Charizard X. I think that's probably the coolest one. And then if we're talking about Shinies, Mega Charizard Y probably is the coolest. But um, Blast Twist is pretty cool too. Venusaur just doesn't really change all that much. I mean, apart from getting a couple more leaves, nothing really happens. All right, guys. So I actually have a ton of vote keys saved up. I haven't actually done a vote key opening in a really long time, and actually, it's it's not as many days as you would think. I mean, it looks like a lot here. I have uh, 66 vote keys, but it's really only 11 days worth of vote keys, so under two weeks. And um, yeah, we're gonna see how this goes now. I don't know what I'm going to get. I know there really isn't too much crazy stuff you can get out of the vote crate just because it is a vote crate and you get a ton of these keys. Um, but we can get some pretty cool TMs and maybe even a Master Ball. So let's just go ahead and spam these open and see what we actually get. I'm sure our inventory is going to fill up pretty soon here, so we should probably be careful of that. We got ourselves a random Pokemon egg, which is pretty cool. Tons of TMs. We actually did get a Master Ball. Um, we got some rare candies, and I think we got mostly Ultra Balls there. Um, so like five TMs, maybe even a couple of EXP shares. What else are we going to get? Let's just keep up. Oh, our inventory is full. Okay. So before we continue, oh, that's a cool Charizard. I don't know. I feel like I might actually like the Halloween Charizard better than the mega evolutions. It's pretty cool. Um, but okay. So let me head home real quick and throw all this stuff away, not throw it away, but put it in our chest. Um, so we got a dig TM. We already had one of those. Um, we got ourselves psychic. We got ourselves Psy Shock. We got ourselves. Where does this go? Shadow Ball. Um, Swords Dance. And. I'm trying to keep things organized. I really. I mean, I might as well just throw them all in the chest, really. Oh, Ice Beam. Okay, so we got ourselves our first Ice Beam TM, which is kind of cool. Uh, Sludge Bomb. Focus Blast. Stone Edge. You go in here. Um, and our first Stone Edge TM. Not too bad. Okay, so let me actually just toss out vines, eggs, feathers. Don't really need any of this. I'm not sure what Mystic Water does, but I'll go ahead and keep it for now. Um, I know I keep my EXP shares over here. We have 14 EXP shares. Those are useful. Um, okay, we got a stick. We got some fish. We got gas deer, gold nugget, and I think everything else I probably want to keep. Um, yeah, let's just let's just keep all of this. We'll actually go ahead and put our Ultra Balls away in the chest, just because we don't need more than a stack. And let's go back to spawn and open up the rest of the Vokies. So we have 30 left, and yeah, okay. Go ahead and just spam all of this out, and we'll look in our inventory. Hey, don't get in my way. I'm trying to open my Vokies. Stop it. Here we go. And there we go. Okay, so that was 66 Vokies all used up. We got another half stack of Ultra Balls. We got a bunch more TMs. Um, a choice scarf, a lot of rare candies. We had 48 rare candies when we started, so almost 64 rare candies. We got 60, so pretty close there. And um, yeah, let me go ahead and open up this random Pokemon egg. I'm trying to get away from these people. They're jumping in front of me. Oh no, I gotta run and hide. Um, but here we go. Okay, let's see. What are we gonna get? Oh, oh, okay. I a cottony. Oh, that's great. You know, that's really that's the Pokemon I really wanted. Out of, out of any Pokemon in the game, I wanted a Cottony. All right, guys, so I'm going to go ahead and actually pick out the winner for the event key from the last episode. It's right here in chat. Ferris underscore, you will have your event key next time you log in the server. If you guys do want a chance to win, 
Um, actually, with the new release of Megas, let's go ahead, if you want a chance to win your choice of Mega Stone, go ahead and leave a like on the video, comment down below with your in-game name, and subscribe to the channel. Make sure you go ahead and do those three things, and I'll pick a random person that will actually get to choose any of the four Mega Stones that are in the game right now. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to go ahead and leave a like, and let me know down in the comments um what you guys are thinking about the new update do you guys like it i i think it's pretty cool i would really like for them to implement a way to get megas outside of battle so that you could actually ride them and whatnot that would be really cool um but i don't know if they're gonna be able to do that either way thanks for watching guys i hope you enjoyed and i will see you next time